Nothing in particular! Nothing, nothing, nothing in particular! What do you do all day long? Nothing in particular. All day long! Nothing in particular. Coming to you live from Nip 34 Studios in the middle of nowhere, your host, Nip! What's going on, YouTube? You and the tube. All right, I'm one of those new fangled semi semi my truck drivers, which basically means that I travel with this. This is a Rand Manali. I believe this is a seven. Oh wait, got some brakes. It's a Rand Manali 740. I've had several of them, not these, but like all of them, and I checked it out. And I got challenged. I got challenged to see if I could do a run that I do at least once a week without the GPS. I mean, quite honestly, like, I never really pay attention to where I go. I just, GPS says turn left, I turn left. It says turn right, turn right. Man, I never really pay attention. But I'm in, where the hell am I? See, I don't even know where I'm at. I'm in East Handover, Pennsylvania. And I gotta get to Edwardsville, Illinois without the GPS. So, I've already done, and I'm not even gonna use a route. Actually, look. I'm gonna turn it off. What is it? Power off. There it is. She's off. So, first of all, I got to get to my house, which is in Ohio. Then I got to get to Edwardsville, Illinois, which is at the southern end. And if I had to guess, somehow I need to figure out how to get from this point to... 68 or something now the only cheat I am going to use Keith I'm about to call you back uh, I'll call you back okay the only cheat I am going to use is I am going to use my phone to route myself now guys when you use your phone to route yourself there is a reason we pay six and five and six and whatever hundred dollars for a truck GPS. It is a truck GPS. It is um, it is not be it's not used to get yourself all the way to a uh, shipper or receiver because the truck GPS knows roads you're not allowed to go onto or knows roads you're supposed to go onto. It knows when. The clearance you got to go is only 13 foot and you're 13 six and eh, not good. So through my trip, I'll check back in with you guys and uh, wish me luck. No GPS. I think it's like 900 and some miles too. update all right so yesterday uh, was a little nerve-wracking without using a GPS I, I kind of got well I didn't get too lost but I was super nervous but uh, I found 322 because I know if I take 322 north to get on uh, 
uh, what is it, 99, I can take 99 to 80, 80 to my house. So, I came to the house, and when I came to the house, I got to sleep in my own bed and pick up Cool Steven. Hi. Cool, really, I think it's here. It's cool. <laughs> so, now, I have to get myself to um, Indi or Indianapolis to go switch trucks and then Edwardsville. So let me start trip planning, do pre-trip, and hopefully I'll just get a little video of us driving there. All right, I was able to do the trip got lost a little bit it turned into a lot of bit but I made it it was a trip that I do all the time so technically I should have made it I guess to sum it all up guys I'm all about my GPS I'm all about poking the numbers and letters in and getting there I look at it this way you know the old drivers can be like Y'all don't, don't know how to get anywhere. If whatever happens if the GPS satellites fall out the sky. We're at war, man. Ain't shit getting nowhere. At least I ain't putting, I ain't taking shit nowhere. Well, what if your GPS breaks? I go buy a new one. So I look at it. So guys, I mean, if you guys can do this without a GPS, but for me, I'm going to use my GPS. Guys, Hit the like button if you like this video. If you're new to me, I'm going to watch some videos. I promise you I'm going to try to do more. Um, I'm trying to work on something with a company to try to see if I can get some like um, sponsorship or something. But, as always, left or closed, right foot down, only when it's safe, guys. See you on the next one. Peace. Yeah, guys, don't forget to check out my son's uh, page. Cool. Steven. <laughs> so cool Steven, guys. Peace.